In this video, we will go over the basics of the BLK360 system. The main pieces of the kit are the scanner, tripod, and batteries. First, let's go over the setup of the tripod. Start by pushing each of the legs in an outward direction. Then, loosen the tension collar on the mounting rod. Once the mounting column is loose, slide it out, turn it over, and reinsert from the top side. Then re-tighten the tension collar. Rotate each leg around until they click into their home position. Last, loosen the ends of the legs by twisting in a clockwise direction and extend them to the desired height. Just re-tighten the legs by twisting in a counterclockwise direction. When you are finished, it will look something like this. Next, we need to insert a charged battery into the scanner. Simply take the scanner, open the battery door, hold it open, be sure the contacts are down, slide it into the battery compartment, and it will click into place. The little lever will overlap the battery slightly, and the door will close. Now we can start up the scanner. Move it so you can see the on button, and push it once. And you will notice the bottom LED light will flash yellow. This is the boot process. Once it is finished, it will turn to a solid green. The boot process takes approximately 20 seconds. If using a tripod, you can go ahead and now mount it to the quick connect. Just be sure you push down both of the tension buttons and it will click right into position. Release the buttons and you have mounted it to the connection. If you choose, you can use the BLK360 without being connected to an iPad. Simply push the on button and you'll notice the LED will start to flash green. It will begin the image taking process when the flashing green turns to flashing yellow. Once the images are taken, it will go ahead and take the scan and be stored on the onboard storage. The scanner is capable of holding around 100 scans and each battery will last around 30 scans. Each image and scan will take about three minutes. Once both scan and image is complete, the bottom LED will return to solid green. Once all your scanning is complete, you can shut down the scanner by once again holding down the on button. Simply push and hold the on button down until you see the bottom LED light flash rapidly yellow. Once it is finished booting down, the LED light will then turn off completely. Should the bottom LED turn a solid red, this is an indication that your BLK360 may have malfunctioned. If this happens, it is best to contact your local technical support for next steps.